She is a fashion designer, author, and philanthropist, but Tina Knowles Lawson will always reign supreme <laughs> as the mother of the queen herself, Beyonce. Now Tina is getting ready for her big moment in the spotlight when she receives the first ever Inspiring Leadership Award during the 2016 Essence Festival in New Orleans the next week. The annual event focuses on empowering women, and Tina will be honored as a pioneer in the entertainment industry. Way to go, girl. That's Thank a big you. deal. And the first ever. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm really excited about it. Yeah, I'm what honored. did it mean to you when they reached out to you and said, we are gonna, we're going to give this to you? Well, the Essence Festival has been such a part of my history. Um, I had a hair magazine back in the 80s, and we, we had booths there, and we premiered Miss Tina, my clothing line there, and it was a place I took my girls because it's in New Orleans. It's great food. It's mm -hmm. great empowerment. It's all these women, powerful women getting together. So for me, it's like almost surreal. I'm, I, I'm really honored to do it. I, I think it's one of the best things mm -hmm. for uh, African Americans to go down sure. and, and enjoy the festival. So. Speaking of powerful women, how about your daughter? I went to her Photo concert. Her city <laughs> no. field show. Do you go to all, the, all of them or do you pick a couple, you cherry pick? Well, I do maybe two to three weeks into the tour so that I can make sure everything's okay. She's okay and then I kind of go to certain cities. Do you know all the words? Do you? Oh, of course. Are you, you're giving her I'm that. I'm not much of a mother if she does album. <laughs> it's, it's, it's really amazing. Uh -huh. We heard um, Beyonce give a speech when she won that big fashion award not too long ago and she spoke wow. about you and your mother and just what what the strength of the women that came before her mean to her and I watched in the audience and you just like wiped a tear away watching your daughter. What was it that, that struck such a chord with you? Well just to see um, you know to think about my mom and what she instilled in me and how she you know took nothing and always turned it into something. Mm -hmm. It was just amazing because, I mean, she was an amazing woman and and to pass that on to me and I've tried to pass it on to my daughters. I mean, now they have access to, to all the beautiful clothes, but back in the day, you know, nobody would give me clothes, but mm -hmm. we took lemons and made them into lemonade. Yes, if you you became a warrior, you say, exactly. at five years old. At five old. years old, I had to. Uh -huh. To survive. To survive. Mm -hmm. Well, it was interesting when you described how your parents had to barter their services at the school so that you could get the education yes. and you had to and just fight through. Right. And then you made Beyonce's prom dress, her Grammy dress, her, you know, her wedding dress, all of her first dresses. I know. She was so sweet to let me do that. <laughs> <laughs> you know, she came back later one day and she said, you know, when my daughter gets married, I'm going to let her pick out her own dress. <laughs> I was like, she said? oh, wait. I mean, maybe she wasn't so excited about it at the time, but yeah, Speaking she's of sweet, a sweetheart. Blue, blue. We're looking at sweet right here. Oh, yeah. Oh, different kind of sweet. Uh, I thought kind you meant Blue sweet. Ivy. So wait, <laughs> you tied the knot with this wonderful man who you've known for a long, long time, yes, right? Yeah, 33 years. Uh-huh. He's just right off camera. Is it hard being this oh. close to him? Why don't you just oh. come over? You might as well come stand next, next to your girl. Please. How oh. could you She's been not? married a little over a year now? Please? Yes, a year in April. Oh, my gosh. And how happy, yeah, how happy are you? Oh, my God. I'm really happy. We're still honeymooning. You are? Yes. <laughs> Tell us about it. <laughs> <laughs> it's been great because we've always had a lot in common, and we're opening a theater together, and we're going to do a lot of nonprofit things to uh, Richard is an amazing acting teacher and he has thousands of students that sure. he's helped and um, and so it's going to be great to uh, put those put two things forces together. together. Yeah, yeah I'm different kind it. of warrior. And right. God bless you both. Thanks yeah. so much for thank being you. with us. You guys, thank, thank you. you so, so much. Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.